Hey guys, going on? My name is Josh. I'm from Kane Productions, and today I'm going to give you a quick little review on the game Dinoside. So, Dinoside is a uh, indie game on Steam. You can get it for five bucks. Actually, I think it's on sale at the moment. Um, but overall, what it is, it's kind of like an arcade-style classic game. Um, it has some features from all around. It really does. It has some features from like. Personally, I'm saying this because my background consists of these games, but it has elements of like Zelda and like um, Mario and stuff like that. And in my in my um, in the way I can kind of like um, compare it, but uh, at the same time, it has its own original feel. I mean, you, there's dinosaurs in the game. It's pretty cool. You get to ride and through lava and stuff. Um, uh, it's really cool graphically because like it is the arcade style graphics, but at the same time it, it's really cool looking. It really does look really nice. Um, so the game has three modes to it. It's got something called speed run. It's got boss rush and story mode. Speed run is is just you know try to get through as quick as you can. Boss rush is trying to defeat the bosses or whatever. And the story mode is you know trying to chronologically. Uh, demonstrate how the game works and stuff so overall the game is a really fun game if you're into these indie style arcade these these you know these small five minute game um, or five minute level games you can complete these levels pretty quick um, and that's why I say this is kind of like an arcade style because it's such a small time for the matches and stuff um, but like I said, there's there's such a large community that appreciates this style of game, so that's why I'm bringing you this. Also, um, I'd like to thank the developer for de uh, for actually giving me a key to, um, to check this game out. Actually, so uh, I really appreciate that. So the only issue I had with this game is I had a lack of understanding for the controls. Um, I couldn't really figure out uh, what all the keys were for. Um, I, I guess you could find that obviously with a Google. I, I didn't really do that. Um, instead, I just tried to figure out the game as I played it. But I really did enjoy it. I figured out the X key was to fire, the C key was to jump. You can d use the WASD keys, but I'd recommend using your um, arrow keys because then you have more access to your X and C. But uh, yeah, guys, overall, I, I really do give this game a thumbs up. It, it's really nice. Um, go check it out. Um, it's really good to support the indie community guys don't forget that because if we didn't support these guys we didn't support all these indie developers out there we would be stuck with these corporations who are making these um, games for profit only uh, a lack of creativity look what happened to the COD franchise it turned into someone's um, you know dream game and then it, it turned into a repetitive creation and now it's completely gone off track the original games were about the world wars you know and then they, they took it completely off track now they're in future warfare there's like flying jumps all kinds of crazy stuff so you know we don't really want to um, embrace these massive corporations they have the majority of profits so we need to support these small guys who come who uh, actually make up like less than like 10% of the market so guys if you enjoyed this game go ahead download it you can get it for five bucks on Steam I think like I said it's on I think it's on sale right now actually it's like four bucks but um, yeah definitely check it out if, if you, this game interests you it's really cheap and it's really fun um, if you guys enjoy the video go ahead hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for some more content